Good morning, guys. Um, this morning, a <clears throat> couple things I would like to show you. First of all, um, at the Akin Face basis, we have a new trending thing called Stable Cassade, which is uh, from Stability AI, and it's, it makes images. But it's really interesting because it shows you the steps it takes, and the end quality is absolutely incredible. Of course, after yesterday's uh, Sora AI, nothing feels like anything close to it, but still, this is really good image generator. So let's try something. Let's try a uh, Phil Collins looking like in his 20s wearing VR glasses. So it starts to hone in on them. image uh, look at the quality look at the quality it, yeah it is kind of like Phil Collins a little bit too pronounced chin but absolutely absolutely uh, kind of interesting interesting VR classes but still to look at the quality uh, how about uh, John Wayne as a space marine uh, let's see let's see let's see let's see let's see look at the quality it's still holding in I think yeah there we go absolutely incredible a sort of a cartoony but still very very good um, Finnish president Daria Hallonen with Conan O'Brien looking at hair care products the joke is that Conan O'Brien, back in like 20 years ago, he realized that the Finnish president Tarja Halonen looks like him. So, um, let's see. Is it gonna be a funny picture? <laughs> that is actually, that is actually, that's actually really, really funny. Uh, I just wonder if it hair care product that looks kind of odd, but yeah, okay. Uh, it, it got the hair. It sort of realized it's a joke. Uh, what else? Uh, uh, what would be funny? Um, let's try something dystopian. Uh, New York City in with flying cars a sort of sci-fi future um, cool actually really really cool kind of a day interesting it did not add like more advertisements and stuff but really cool looking cars and uh, absolutely yeah uh, so this is at hackingface.co spaces multimodal art staple cassette uh, staple line cassette. Another thing I would like to talk about is this. This is a couple month old thing. Yesterday I was showing you guys uh, the, how you can turn something into a Gaussian planning model. I used the uh, Sora AI's uh, girl in a train. The problem with that was that whenever you have like uh, if you take like something that's filmed like from a train window it does not make a good model. It basically to make a good model you have to revolve around object and because of that the other guy who made the another Gaussian splatting model out of uh, Sorai AI video was better because it was sort of revolving but this is two month old paper and this is based on the Gaussian splatting stuff and this is basically they made a thing that turns the world into Gaussian splatting model in real time. So this sees the world as in Gaussian splatting thing. And uh, what could this be used for? Well, the thing about this is that it's not necessarily... If you had like a VR classes, it would model the world around you. Like I've been saying that if you had VR classes that did this, then you could share the world. Like if you had, a, let's say that you had a party in your place 
You could have people uh, drop in your party. They could see your house as it is right now. They could see whatever is going on. And basically, it would allow you to share places in real time. But the interesting thing is that it shows how sort of you can kind of see the glitches. And when you go down here, you can see what it's based on. It's based on this mathematical model. And you would say that this is kind of like, hey, this looks creepy, this looks creepy. But now we are going to go to a serious subject, which is my brain damage. And um, because of it, at worst, I was seeing sort of these sorts of glitches in the world. A um, few years back, every now and then, I would have these bright spots appear in my vision. And I think it's due to, I had my, especially like here, uh, I had low uh, natri natrium values because of my epilepsy medication and it was stuff like that would happen. I still get sometimes on a white surface, I get this weird, like, like uh, the world is a little bit alive. But frankly, I think the reason is something a little bit like this. The hardware is glitching a little bit. So in essence, our brain does something like this. And when you're young, of course, you see everything's perfect, you, everything is fine. But especially when you get like brain damage, you start to realize that holy crap, the world is not really what I'm looking at. The world is a recreation inside my brain, and what the brain does, it's not it's not something too different from this. The neurons are doing calculations, and uh, it's doing some complicated complicated stuff like this. And what we perceive is reality is actually the end result of neuronal calculation but yeah that got sort of serious uh, there is one that is super cool that I would like to show and it's comfy UI 3D pack and this is incredible because what it does, it takes a picture and turns it into into Gaussian uh, into Gaussian model. So you can actually uh, make a 3D model out of a picture. So, like in principle, if you have you want to turn all photos into 3D objects, you can use this. It is very, very hard to install. I have tried to install this, but I have not been able to. Uh, also, the, the, the models are pretty low quality, so it's not high quality yet, but this sort of technology is gonna be absolutely amazing because like when you couple this with something like the Sora AI, you create an environment. Uh, with the Sora AI, you make a video, you turn that into Gaussian, and you drop that environment inside a 3D editor then you can populate it with uh, characters you are just picking from photos so this is gonna speed up for example game development real real a bunch but of course there's all sorts of problems like the Gaussian spreading environments being sort of crappy still they sort of still have this this weirdness about them this part so um, they're not really like high quality polygon maps, but uh, people are working on all of this. But yeah, I hope you guys are well and have a good day, guys. Bye.